Yo, this is Itano Plays, Final Fantasy VI. We've gone through the scenario of Terra, Edgar and Bannon, and we also completed the scenario of Sabin, where he met with Shadow, and Shadow left. We also have Sign on our team and Gao, which are now heading to Nosh, which means we only have one scenario left to do, and I'm gonna do now the final scenario, which is Scenario of Luck. Let us see what happens with him. Locke has worked hard to stimmy the efforts of the Imperial troops in South Figaro, but now he desperately needs to escape. Okay, not looking very good, shall we say. It was that bad. Oh, bad. Oh, this is crap. Damn it! Gotta get the nausea on the fly! Oh, yeah, of course. We haven't done anything with his gear since uh, quite a while ago. Let's give him some stuff. Let's give him, for example... We don't even have the sprint shoes anymore. Oh boy. I hope the relic shop is open here, because I need the sprint shoes. Duncan's house. Rich people homes always have secret passages. We just have to search until we find a place where we can feel a draft. Now, what she said right now is actually going to be very important for us. Okay, let's just wander a bit around here. Be careful. There are some ways we can get yourself annihilated. If you talk to that guy, for example, you'll get destroyed. So be careful. Let's see what we can do here. Is there someone living here? Oh, here's another man. I don't like strangers. Bring me some cedar and maybe I'll talk to you. Okay, so you want some cider or cedar. I don't know how to pronounce it. You want some drink at least. So if you give him some drink, you want to talk with you. And that maybe he has some useful information. Let's see. We go up here in the item shop. Let's see what we can find. Stay away from those armored soldiers. They'll kill you just for talking to them. That sounds really bad. You got anything to sell? Yeah, it does. What is this guy though? What's up? You're the famous thief Locke, aren't you? Oh no! Oh, now that was just plain rude. I'm a treasure hunter, don't, don't forget it. Whoa, we're gonna fight! Okay, so the thing here is that... It looks like a merchant. Merchants probably have cedar, don't they? What if we steal the cedar from him? do steal. Okay. Try again, then. Steal again. There you go, plum hat. Whoa! We stole his clothes as well. Here we go. A little tight. But the prize was right. Phew! Whoa, that's pretty... Pretty crazy. Why do I always have to go and open my mouth? Check this out. We're a merchant! Maybe the guy will accept us now that we're a merchant, not like just ordinary lock. Let's try it out. This is kind of the part of the, the scenario here with lock. You have to dress yourself around to get through. No cedar? What are you doing here? I'm sorry. I don't have any cedar, sir. My grandpa used to be a servant of the richest family in town. You're a merchant, right? Okay, go ahead. Oh, how nice of you, kid. Okay, so we need to get some cedar from this guy. Where can we find the cedar, though? I'm not buying anything. Okay. This guy doesn't really like me. Let's see. What if we go up right here? Maybe the shops are open. Maybe they got some new stuff since last time? If they sell anything. Not the same shit. Okay. I got through from here, but let's see what's up here. Damn, we should have had spin shoot. This is so slow. Oh well. Let's see what we have here. Green guy? What are you doing here? Scram! Really? Cadet? A back attack as well? I wonder, should we? 
try to steal it from me. Let's steal it. Hmm. Maybe we should take it close, become a cadet of our own. Then we could probably walk around these guards. There we go. Haha! -ha! So his clothes as well. Okay, let's change clothes again. They're a bit too large, but he didn't charge. Nice jokes there. Look, is so rude. They just took the guy's clothes. Okay, now we are a guard. Pretty cool. Now we can talk to the guards and then maybe they can be nice to us. Maybe they can tell us some juicy secrets. That'll be something, because this place doesn't really seem very safe right now. The Empire is completely controlled over this place. Let's see. Go around here, maybe up here. Let's see if this guy wants to buy anything from us now. That idiot Kefka is about to invade Nosh. Oh, of course, I know better than to call him that to his face. Kefka is invading Nosh? Oh shit, this is bad. The attachment should be making its way towards Nosh as we speak. We'll be linking up with them soon. Halt! What do you think you're doing? Oh, is my shift up already? Great! I'll go take a break. Whoa! That's nice of him. He just left. I go straight into the inn as well. Probably gonna go sleep. But... Hmm, I wonder. Is the relic shop open? Hold on, where is the relic shop again? It's supposed to be here. Where well, is the inn part? Of course. Here we go. Yeah, sprint shoes, please. There we go. Now we have sprint shoes. A bit more than that for now. Let's put them on. Let's equip a relic. Sprint shoes. Yes, finally, we're safe. Um, should we poison darkness or should we prevent imp and silence? I'd rather have imp and silence. Imp is crap. Yeah, now we're walking fast. This is better. We need to get some cedar. Where's the cedar here? Maybe it's here? No, it's not here. Perhaps it's here. Unless it's just a merchant. Hmm, where can it be? Oh, yeah, of course down here. Aha. Hey you, came to steal my scissor did you? You dirty little thief. Oh, of course we are. Come here merchant. We need to close again. Aha, we got a plum head as well. Now let's go back to becoming a merchant again. This guy didn't like me stealing his clothes, that's fine. Run away if you want. I'm looking much better. Now we got the cedar. Now let's go back to the old man again at the other side of town and see what he has to say to us now that we got his cedar. Remember that we are no longer a, um, a guard now, so be careful with the soldiers you speak to. Especially those on Magitek armors, you don't want to talk to them at all. Because if you actually do, they might actually kill you. I'm not kidding. So just boys, we can get past again. Thank you. Let's just go uh, up here. Ah, sitter. Mmm, it's a good passage. Well, there, yes, there's a tunnel from here to the mansion on the north end of town. Go downstairs and tell my grandson the password. It's. Uh, I forget. You forget? What allows you. Okay, let's see what the password can be, though. The password is... Rosebud Courage Failure. What do you think is the most positive of these things? I think Courage. I'll show you the secret entrance. Great. Courage is what you want. So we go through this secret entrance now. Where does the one lead us? Out of town, perhaps? I'm going to this building. That's pretty nice. An elixir from the clock. That's nice. Aha, well now we're in this building. We can't really go past with the other guard. That's nice. Now, where's this secret passage?
Thanks to our inside information, this town fell with almost no resistance. The Imperial troops have turned this house into their headquarters. Really? Let's go up here then. Maybe it's here? Ah, these kids are driving me nuts. Can't they keep quiet for two minutes? Win the clock, win the clock. And that was just a jump rope rhyme. Clang, 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 I might have take armor. <laughs> funny kids. Win the clock, win the clock. It must be funny. Oh, what have I done? I betrayed my town to the Empire. All I could think of was the money. Did you hear that? Sounds like a draft. From behind here? Aha! Secret entrance. What can this mean? Hmm... I'll remove the clothes. We don't need them anymore. Maybe something in here? I know I've seen her before. Wait a second! She's one of the Empire's generals! What? He's right, that's... Who's... This is what happens to traitors! Aha, she's a character! A magic knight forged by the Empire and tempted in battle. None have better truly have known the woman beneath the General's guise. Producing Celis. So she is actually a good person. That's nice. So the mighty Celis has fallen. Not as far as those who'd use their strength to oppress the weak. Quiet! Kefka's planned to poison every last man, woman, and child in the King of Doma. Shut up! Huh. Run the mouth of yours while you still can. Your execution is tomorrow. Keep a close eye on her. Yes, sir. I can send a guard for days without sleep. Celis. Where's Locke? Oh, he's hiding up there. What a clever man. Clever man, Locke. There we go. Is this guy sleeping or? He is sleeping. Let's go nurse Celis. Her hands are bound. Mm, let's remove her bindings. And you are. Name's Locke. I'm with the Returners. You're a Returner? I'm... or at least I was, General Salas. I'm nothing but a traitor. Well, let's get going. You take me with you? No, I can barely walk. I never make it out of here. I appreciate, but even if you got me out, you won't be able to protect me. I'm better off waiting here for the executioner. At least that way I'll keep my pride. I'll protect you. Trust me, you'll be fine. That wink. Let's go. Wait! This soldier might have something on him that could help us get out of here. Okay, let's check him out. There's a clock key in his pocket, let's take it. All clocky. Whoa! Uh oh. More soup and... Phew. That guy is still in the sleep. Okay. Now we can move on. You can save here if you need to. Go here. Have to go around these things. Get this clock though. No clock, it's ticking. Okay, so we have to win the clock, but we have to find a clock that's not ticking. A lot of money. No, nothing in there though. That's kind of crap. The clock is not ticking. Let's win the clock. Aha! There we go. Now we're in for a little maze in order to get through this place. This place has a lot of hidden places in order to go through. Enemies, of course. Vector Hound. 
Oh, yeah, I forgot to equip Celis. She's not equipped at all. Whoops. So the cool thing about Celis, though, you see that? Even though know, the dog just said run away, but Celis knows magic! I'm wondering what the hell Celis knows magic? Yes, cure, poisoner, blizzard, and imp. Hmm, that's kind of cool, though. Why does she know magic? Get some iron armor. Let's equip her with stuff. We don't have a shield for her, though, but we have some plum hat and iron armor. That's pretty good. At least she's more decked now. That's pretty good. But wow, how does she know magic? I mean... Do you remember, though? Terra was a soldier of the Empire. He used, of course. Celeste was a general of the Empire. Oh, two new items for Celis. Great sword and a heavy shield. Now she's decked. Let's put on some relics for her too. Let's see. Uh, fairy ring and... Go on the earring as well, because she can use magic. Got some more enemies. Vector Hound, times two. Oh, this one wants to fight. He wants to flee. Coward dog. Maybe it's cowardly the dog. Maybe it's just, they're in the same family. From the commander. So there are soldier here, actually, after all. This doesn't hit me. There we go. Let's flee again. That's fine. Aha! You know where secret entrance is everywhere? Three commanders! Let's try to fight them all. So far, so good at least. Last one too. Desperate strike. I hurt a bit. Not that much, but I hurt a bit. A bit. There we go. We go here as well. We can. Or not. More enemies. Vector hounds and the commander again. Let's try to kill the dogs. It seems like one of them runs away all the, all the time, and the other one is getting killed. There we go. Will they run away now, or will they fight? Oh, I won't run away. Chicken dog. Dog chicken? Chicken dog. I guess we can go here and up. I almost said it. Work their hounds on the commander again. Let's just fight him again. Let's take care of the commander after we take care of the dog. Let's see if the one wants to fight now. You flee. It's Bye. This XP is not that bad, even though we're only two characters still. And again. First the hounds doesn't want to fight me, and now they want to fight me. Now we kill them both, so that's nice. Good XP at least, that's been nice. Look up here. Why are you helping me? You remind me a lot of someone. What's the matter, anyway? I'm helping you because I want to. Well, that's nice of you, Locke. And are we gonna get through here? Are there no soldiers around? Phew, we got out. Okay, so we are of South Figaro, but we're not done yet. We also have to go a bit further so we can go out to Nosh. Remember the cave we came to uh, South Figaro from when we were with uh, Edgar and Terra as well? I'm gonna go through that cave in the next episode and hopefully things will have not changed since last time. But do you think there might be some changes? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it might be. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you got some feedback or want to talk about this game, leave a comment below. Also do make sure to subscribe to my channel to get some content updates, and uh, that's gonna be it for now. So I'll see you guys next time as my story of Final Fantasy VI continues.